Oh, it's even worse. Somebody just threw some Bondo in there, so we're gonna have to we're gonna have to clean that up and weld all that up. We gotta turn the truck around so we can work on that side. I don't think we're gonna be able to start it up. Ah. Ah, there we go. Really don't need that much. It's been a while since I start, uh, we started this up. It's crazy you can see the... Oh, it's... Oh, oh. Something's scraping. Oh yeah. Does the brake still work? Yep. Through the fence. You out of gas? I wonder why we can't jump it off. You might be out of gas. Hello everyone, welcome back to the 1975 Chevy C10 build. Today we are actually gonna be taking out the windshields and we're gonna be looking at this side of the truck. And this truck so far looks terrible. Uh, we're gonna have to try to fix it up and do some more wells. But we're taking the back windshield out as well, and then we're going to be trying and to see what other stuff we could do before then. We are actually putting the tailgate on hold right now, and we're going to work on this. Because if you've seen in the last episode, we finished that side. And so we flipped this truck around, as you could see earlier, and we're actually looking and accessing the damage on this side. And it seems like there's some unrepairable damage over here, especially. Uh, so we're going to have to figure something out over here. And some somebody for us actually put Bondo over here and just try to fix it up. So let's get into the video. Less talking and more work and let's get into it. see see what it looks like there we, if it's just that right there we can fix that that part somebody tried to drill a total of 19 holes over here for testing out different mirrors and we already know which mirror that we need to put on there so we only need these two holes and those two holes so we're gonna have to in the future weld up all these holes and just clean it all up. As y'all could see in the beginning of the video, this back, these back tires were spinning out and it's probably because all of the weight has been gone on the back with no bed. And also, uh, it was not working properly. And I think it's because that we don't have much gas left in the tank and whenever we're on a slope, it pushes the gas forward and it causes the truck not to run properly and backfiring a whole lot.
Clearly see where somebody tried to bondo it all up on both sides. All that bondo coming off. Got the seat out. Now it's time to do the second seat. We got both the seats out. The passenger seat was the easiest and the driver's seat was the hardest. Now we resorted to using the speed out. Because this screw is stripped so the speed out should hopefully work. I got from Lowe's. Oh yeah. Be cleaned up. Oh gross, yeah. It smells oily, like they put WD forty all over it.
it's all rotted. Ah. Rotted in here. So we might have to get another one. You best bet we get another one. Dang. Yeah, there's no saving this. So we finally got the front end off, the front grill, and the right fender. So now this is fenderless and it has no grill. Uh, might end up taking off the bumper. And we gotta paint all this black. And see if there's any much anything else really to do. Because we gotta prep it. Now this is barely bolted on. It has one bolt over there. It's bolted on. If I don't trip. And then we're going to have to, I don't think we're going to take it off, but we're going to replace the bolt. So far, it looks very rusty right here. It's from the battery. The battery could have leaked some time and corroded all that. Yeah, but we're not going to, I mean, you can get another inner fender if you want to. Yeah. It's up to you. It depends on how much it costs, really. See, that's where it's all rusted out. Only on this side, though. You might. Might be able to sand it down and paint it. So now we're moving on to the rocker panels and the inner rocker panels. And possibly the cab corner. So, let's get into it. completely forgot we need to get the fuel tank out first before we start welding or cutting. It's a bad idea to cut with fuel. That's all shot. Dang, that's bad too. There's a fuel tank right there. See, I can't. I don't even cut that because the fuel tank here. I don't want to hit it. Oh yeah. Or weld, and there'd be a leak. And blow us up. Which, I need to clean it off anyway, the gas can, gas tank.
Got to go get the gas can. So I used degreaser and the brush to get all the gunk and the dirt off and possibly some of the gasoline residue and it took a long time but I finally got it all cleaned up. The water hose got the rest of the loose dirt off before I went ahead and degreased it. However, in the last video I got a comment and they were uh, explaining that they were, this video series has been reminding them of when they used to work on stuff with their father and I am happy that uh, with the positivity in these videos and I'm glad I could affect people in a positive way. Alright guys, so now it's time to spray paint this thing. Okay guys, so I finally finished painting up the gas tank, however it's not perfect as you can see there's still some spots where yeah, I could have just sanded it down but this really ain't going to be seen all that much so it doesn't really matter. It's All that matters is if it looks very clean, in which it does, so hopefully uh, it wouldn't matter too much because it would be under the cab and so we cleaned it all up, we painted it and I think it looks decent you see some spots where you know it wasn't cleaned very well but um, overall I think it looks pretty good we just found a rat nest there was a rat in here it jumped out and went under the stairs and died but there's the nest oh. all the insulation it hoarded up Well, that's where it's been living. Yeah, the dead rat's over there, so. 
guys that's gonna be it for today's video we got a ton done we took off the fender and we took out all the windows and we figured out a lot of stuff we also took off the grill so it really took a little while but i enjoyed it so i hope y'all enjoy and stay tuned for the next episode we're gonna be doing some more work on multiple things i don't know just yet but please subscribe and like and i'll see y'all in the next video